welcome back to the channel everyone in this video we got some lore farming to show you the lore I'm talking about is the man they call Cade now this can be done during a heroic story mission ace in the hole and the ace in the hole won't always be available but on the days it is you can run it a few times and you'll have all that lore book filled out I would say it took me about a half an hour running it getting about one to three lore entries per run. Now if you guys watch the video, I'm going to show you where all these ten chests are located. Now if you don't want to watch the video to see where the ten chests are, you don't have to. If you simply start the mission, if you run through the whole thing, get to the very end and get the chest at the end, then when you turn around and run back through it towards the beginning, it will show you where every chest is located by putting a marker on your HUD. I also want to mention that this quest is only available if you have gone through and got the Ace of Spades. And as always guys, if this video helps you out, go ahead and give it a like, go ahead and share it so your friends can get this whole book filled out. Newcomers to the channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you want to see some more day 2 content like this. This one's for the fellow who calls himself the Drifter. You did warn me running with you would put a target on my back. I guess I'm in good company, though, huh? After all, never had any fun without a little risk. That's the whole idea with the operation you're putting together, isn't it? My idea, by the way, had it like a million years ago back when you were still handsome. So, uh, you're welcome. You know, getting that up and running means coming out of hiding. Giving you-know-who another shot at you. Hope I was around to see that showdown. Personally, my money was on the guy with the golden gun. But hey, what do I know? I'm dead. Petra, if you're listening to this, you killed me. Maybe the Sovs, in all their mysterious wisdom, decided they were sick of me? If the Queen ordered the hit, I guess I understand. If you're a real glutton for chivalry. But if it was Aldrin, I'm this. Just thinking about that peacock gives me a headache. But I'm betting my death was not a case of your famous collateral damage. Because you're a real do-gooder. But seriously, it's annoying. But good deeds never go unpunished when you're around. You just... you gotta blast radius. Well, it was fun while it lasted. Go. Oh. for some advice. One, know your people. Like my Nessus got quite this ring. I like to call her about once a moon, else she gets a little too much night. Not enough stalker, you know? Two, keep your weapons sharp. Your job's to watch everyone's back, which means no one's watching yours but you. And three, start thinking now about what you want to do for your successor's Vanguard Dare. Because trust me, kid, this gig will kill you. <laughs> sorry, sorry, I'm just, I'm imagining how awkward you must look right now. <laughs> So, I'm dead. You killed me. My stuff is yours. No more working me over at chess. No more getting worked over at poker. For real, though. You know that if you needed to kill me for the good of the city or whatever, I totally understand. No hard feelings. Now, you can put this voice recording away and go on with your life. Now, if you did have some kind of lingering guild or something, that would be rough. Because you and I both know you'd have me yapping in your ear for the rest of your days. You wouldn't be able to help yourself. So you know I'm making a bunch of these, right? I probably told you. I always gotta have the last word, and I'm gonna be prepared for every possibility. But to tell the truth, this one's the easiest to make. So long as we're being honest, I could never tell if you really like me that much. But, uh, well, if you did hate me, the feeling was not mutual. In fact, yeah, I'll say it. Don't even mind that you killed me. I figure if we threw down, first off, no one can blame me for losing. And I know you'd be in the right. So, thanks, I guess. You were a, a good friend. <laughs> 